everybody and welcome to Clear Path Guidance and Tarot. I'm going to do a relationship reading on Ivanka Trump and Jared Kushner. All right, so um, the energies that pick up between these two are very businesslike. I feel, uh, you know, the Ivanka is very smart and I feel that she makes decisions based on oh, thought and reason and so does he. I looked up their birth dates before I started this reading because sometimes I forget and then I do it uh, while I'm doing the reading. I will look it up. He's a Capricorn. She's a Scorpio. She's born October 30th. So um, she should be ruled by her feelings. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces make decisions based on feelings. Um, so I find she's very, very analytical and she's very poised and very structured. She reminds me of Lady Diana. Not that they're the same kind of women, but very, you'll, you'll, you kind of never see what's going on inside. She's very poised. Even if she's having a bad day, I feel like Ivanka can put that, um, face on. So, um, clearly she works at the White House. So does her husband. I think that I'm not talking about any decisions that they make for the country, working for the government or anything like that. I'm talking about business decisions. I'm talking about decisions within their marriage. I feel nothing is done abruptly. They both think things through when it comes to making decisions. Now, she changed her uh, religion to Jewish uh, because he is Jewish. Um, she loves him very much. I feel this relationship is so structured. I feel like everything is, I keep getting this well thought out. You know, the kids have a certain bedtime. Their, their, their lives are structured a certain way. Um, I believe her dad really values her opinion because of the decisions she's made in, in the past. Now, I'm not a fan of anybody here, all right? But not one of Donald's children have ever been in any of the media for any scandal. You look at Paris Hilton. Um, you look at um, some of these, I don't want to say child stars, but some of these people that are in the public eye you look at them and a lot of them have had some sort of a scandal. Kim Kardashian. But honestly, you can look at all of Donald's children and not one has had a scandal growing up. They were, I feel like they were all straight A students. There was a lot of expect, lot expected of them. So I feel she's very smart. She's educated. I feel that the relationship between her and Jared are, um, is very balanced. They love each other very much. They respect each other. They respect each other's opinions. I feel like he's a good dad. She's a good mom. I don't feel they're together for money. I think they both have their own money. Um, I just think that they really complement each other a lot. And they're two of a kind. They both think the same way, feel the same way. Um, I don't feel like there's a whole lot of romance here. I feel it is more... Uh, structured, structured in every way. So I feel like they love each other and I feel like it is a very strong marriage. I don't feel that failure is an option for Ivanka. I think she's seen her mom and dad's failures and she wouldn't have converted to Judaism if she didn't love this man that much and know that this man was going to be it for her. All right. So, and I feel like Jared really loves her a lot. He really does. It's, I, I feel like it's a good solid marriage. I really do. I feel that they just kind of know what their roles are and, uh, what each needs to do in the relationship. Okay. All right. Not much to say here. I'll go to the cards, see what the cards say. Thank you. 
What are the messages? They're good business people, too. Regarding Ivanka and Jared. What are the messages? Like, he comes from money, does he not? I thought I saw a documentary about how he's a slumlord or something like that. I hope not. But, um, you know, he comes from money and she comes from money. And they have their own money. Like, I think she's got, like, a perfume line and, you know, all kinds of things like that. And I think he's just a businessman, right? Okay. What are the messages between Ivanka and Jared? What are the messages between Ivanka and Jared? What are the messages regarding Ivanka and Jared? What are the messages regarding Ivanka and Jared? What are the messages between Ivanka and Jared? All right, so these two like to create things together. All right, there's the Ace of Wands. This is also about passion. I feel that there is a lot of passion between them. I don't feel like these two are going to ever get divorced. Um, I feel like the, the relationship is very strong. Yes, money matters to them. I feel marriage matters to them. Their family unit really matters to them. She's seen a lot, right? So I think it's very important for her to keep things together. Um, this is about an inspiration to create something. There's passion here between the two of them. And they want to create something together. All right. I feel like Ivanka, if she sees a problem um, arising, I think she she catches it and fixes it before it gets any worse. So, for example, if she's starting to feel like she's not spending much time with him and he's working too much, she will say to him, we need to do something about this now. All right. She wants to fix it right away. All right. We have the Eight of Cups. And so the energies between them. So this is about, um, this is like when I look at this card, it's moving on from the clutter. Sometimes when it gets too much, they turn their back and they'll go regroup and regroup together and make sure that their relationship is solid. And then we have the three of wands and the three of wands is teamwork. All right. This is manifestation. This is them knowing what they want and creating it. There's a lot of creating here going between the two of them. And Donald, out of all his children, I guess I should call him president. I don't know. But Donald Trump looks at her as being the most level headed and strongest and reliable and responsible, um, good decision maker. Um, she is the best out of all the children. So he really looks at her for her opinion. He really values her opinion. Okay. What are the future messages regarding Ivanka and Jared? What are the future messages regarding Ivanka and Jared? Future messages regarding Ivanka and Jared. the future messages regarding Ivanka and Jared. What are the future messages regarding Ivanka and Jared? What are the future messages regarding Ivanka and Jared? Future messages regarding Ivanka and Jared. All right, so what are the future messages? There's the Two of Pentacles, and this is about multitasking, it's choices, weighing options. I feel that these two can multitask no problem, all right? Um, they weigh out their options very, very um, uh, uh, detail-wise, all right? But this is about just a good balance, and they weigh options all the time. We have the Ace of Pentacles. This talks about a relationship that's very stable. Okay, the Ace of Pentacles also talks about prosperity, winning, business, property. Um, this includes new property, founding a new enterprise, stable relationship, 
Overall, the card reveals financial security and contentment. They will always have financial security and contentment. And then we have the Five of Wands. And the Five of Wands signifies challenges, obstacles, sports play. Sometimes there's conflict, but this is just minor, minor stuff. This is um, just uh, fun play as well. Okay, the two of them might be somewhat, um, this talks about being competitive between each other. All right. Okay, there you go. So if anybody is interested in purchasing a private reading, I'm going to leave my information. My email will be at the bottom of the video. You can email me. I'll get back to you within 24 hours. And I have the readings out within uh, less than five days. I'm a clairsentient, clairvoyant. As a clairsentient, I pick up other people's emotions feelings. Um, uh, that's how I do my readings. It's called Reading People. It's where I shine. I do my best work. And um, I'm also clairvoyant. So I can see images. I can see pictures in my mind. All right. So thank you for watching, sharing, liking, subscribing. I'm also going to leave my PayPal uh, in the comment section if anybody wants to donate to the channel. Donations are welcome. All right. And thank you for watching. All right. Bye-bye.